Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. I am Yezrul. Welcome, welcome to Warhammer 40,000 Chaos Gate Demon Hunters. Or as everyone's just taking to call it here, XCOM 40K. We're going to find out if this is going to be, well, a worthy successor. I mean, they've got from the previews XCOM style gameplay and, well, we all know how well that works. And the 40k license and universe is pretty well suited, particularly when you are fielding the Space Marines. And in this case, the Space Marines, Space Marines, the Grey Knights. So they are very well suited to that kind of small squad level action. Unlike, say, the Death Corps, where, let's be honest here, it's more a case of, hmm, line up your toy soldiers, then get a dustpan and brush and just, you know, Yes, we have lost 100 men and taken 3 feet of ground. An excellent rate of exchange. The Emperor will be pleased. Gonna dive straight into the campaign and we'll, that's it, just see how it goes. Let's see where we take it from there. So, our good old friends, the Nurglites. Hmm, yes, the Far Future's Soap Dodgers. Let's see what they're up to. So, new campaign. Select difficulty, merciful, plus two knights, standard. And then we have ruthless, plus 25% HP. And plus 50%, the knights start with one resilience, less requisite, all manner of horrible things. Grandmaster mode, disables manual saving, so no scumming. Right, let's go with standard. And just see how this plays out. I am not going to try Grandmaster Mode just because I have been um, slightly hoiked up by autosaves before when streaming. Also, please note the photosensitivity warning that may or may not be for show. It is the 41st millennium. For more than a hundred centuries, the Emperor has sat immobile on the golden throne of Earth. Mankind wages a never-ending battle for survival against the demonic power of the Chaos Gods. But by one force is humanity shielded from true darkness. The Grey Knights. This secret chapter of Space Marines are the Imperium's surest defense against that which the Emperor foresaw would be its greatest threat. No, he's not Humanity's about blade against the demon. For in the grim darkness of the far future, there is only war. And whatever happens, we will not be missed. So, quick summary of the setting. Yeah, that, that all works. Alright. What are we doing, however? Shrinerold, Geheris, and Dimian Cluster, Solution, Tertius. I'm identified as Sartes' vessel. This is Captain Parani Everick of the warship Holiness of Ra. Geheris is lost. Repeat, Geheris is lost. All Imperial vessels are to withdraw at once. No reply, of course. A Sartes' vessel, do you read me? Geheris is due. Please acknowledge this warning. The Grey Knights are not chatting about Go, huh. in the Emperor's light. You cannot sail into this storm. Yes, we can. It's what we do. We do what we must. Farewell, Captain. He, um, Tech priest, apparently we have a few deaths. are under maximal pressure. Commander, we cannot maintain this orbit for long. Dispatch the assault team at once. I will join them and put an end to this myself. Your will be done. Right. So we're breaking the ship. Pretty much par for the course on this busted of a planet. The assault team is engaged, Commander. They clear a path for your arrival. Here I stand. One unbreakable shield against the darkness. Here I stand, having Tonight forgotten to put my helmet on. Falls, Hector, our quest is finally near its end.
And yes, the, the uh, teleporter, the Warhammer 40k equivalent of the transporter, it, um, it basically flings you through hell, which is why I'm mildly surprised that he didn't have his helmet on for that little trip. So, down we go, beaming straight into a world that is on the point of turning into a rift. Palamedes, report. We have cleared a path through this chap. Our target lies ahead. Lovely. Time is against us, brothers. We breach the cathedral. Okay. So, move, and it's a left click, and then left click again to confirm. Just ah, in case. Deluded zealots. Your oh. shall burn! He's got a heavy stubber. How cute. Advancing into cover. Okay, so stand lexicon drills there. And punish that craven fool. Right. By which you mean move and melee attack. Hey, you might actually survive this. Brother, you're Nemesis Halberd will require sharpening when we return. Alright, move melee attack. Actually gain three action points per turn. Select ranged attack. There we go. And press left to target the cultist. And then confirm again. Ranged turn to deal with four damage, one armor piercing. Right. Okay, so basically. These guys know how to shoot. These are not your typical XCOM grunts. Face the Emperor's judgment. Frankly, considering what a storm bolt of fires, that's well, it's mildly surprising that he is actually capable of um, but still standing. All right, reload it now so you can use it. So five, quick reload, and then left mouse to confirm. Done. I will end that heretic! Ah, that's nice. Right, so partial cover, some reduction. Okay, off you go, Iolanthus. Bonk, 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 bonk. I mean, I, you could criticise Brother Iolanthus for not being in cover, but, um... He is wearing armour roughly akin to a small tank, and they have got a uh, calibre 50 and a few auto pistols between them, so it's, uh... Not a huge deal if he eats a few hits. Justice. And yes, that is roughly what Uther, a bolt does. Dispense of that heretic with your blade. Alright. Next. Press the select well, melee no target. Quarter. Yes, commander. And confirm maneuver. I am the Emperor's Fury. Thump, 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 thump. Bang. You're out of cover, Uther. Trust in the Aegis. Right. And... Mind armor! Gods be with me! Pathetic. <laughs> <laughs> Die, Imperial Dog! <laughs> it actually just wait. do something. Just wait! Wretch. <laughs> Overwatch. Knights acting within the Overwatch zone will be shot immediately. Time stands against us. I will breach the cathedral. Right. Move your camera into the cathedral. Breach the door by moving Agravain into the cathedral. Okay, that works. I mean, let's face it. Terminator armor, even more than the standard power armor, basically turns you into a walking tank. Or in this case, a running tank. Set destination. Demons, I will not be delayed by these weaklings. Ah, oh, hey. Love letters. Well, let's have some fun. Select the pillar. Has this environment I can identify by that? Oh, and it tells you. Oh, that's very obliging. Mind you, this is the tutorial, isn't it? Align the template with the guide. And going down. Iolanthus, your brother is pimped. Advance and deliver retribution. Yes. So, move. By your command. 
deploy um. your frag grenade, brother. Aha! Who wants an exploding boom? None of you tough, I wasn't asking. We are hammer! Apparently we are also... Deliver the Emperor's judgment, Uther. Yes, Gandir's Uther, Interceptor, and also Dab Hand with a sword. Advance and train your bolter on that doorway. Aha, so our introduction to Overwatch. Deliver. Unleash your blessed ammunition the moment they are exposed. Right, so engage Overwatch and... Okay, it's quite a narrow cone compared to XCOM, isn't it? It's only about, what, 15 degrees, give or take? Boop. And confirm. Palamedes, prepare for the demon's charge. Right, so set up there. At once, Move to destination and also sets up an Overwatch arc. Huh. So they've got, what, three shots between them and there are four demons. This may not end well, but we'll find out. All right, blood for the... Oof. Turns out they... I will not fail you. Ah, they don't actually die. Okay, they are space moves. I suppose they qualify as being... A bit more hardcore than your excellent thing. Ah, right, I see, Tatu. I will go and yell at the bot later. Clearly, the machine spirit requires re-education. I sense dark powers from within. Um, that may just be your uh, breakfast, brother, Captain. Right. Rear strike. It just it means with melee weapons will automatically strike if you move out of range, so they get a free hit. Hmm. Or we... You're going to make me do this, aren't you? I can't just... Go for the, uh... Smack. Oh, well. Move. He did say he was going to need to be, uh... Option, to be quick about this. Set destination. Psychic spread attack. These soulless curves shall hinder us no longer. Or we could have just, you know, stabbed them. Okay, how badly is this going to backfire? End that demon, Palamedes. Engage him now. Okay, melee attack. Um. Crashes. And okay, auto defense parry cancels the first melee attack. But not the second. I, I can't we help cannot it. lose another battle, Think brother Iolanthus. Uh... Both demons must be destroyed. Right, and this is mildly awkward. I hope Iolanthus has a plan. So. Right, confirm melee strike. Precision targeting. Select the torso for a bonus to stun. Yoink! Is that because we select it? The jaws of your master. Possibly. A stunned enemy will always be critted by your next attack with easy access to precision targeting. And confirm. Execute. All night. Oh! So you get the execution and everyone gets a bonus attack. Bonk. And then the apothecary. Yeah. And you can enhance most of one will power this called full strike. Right, so you can uh, power everything up. Despite the fact that an apothecary really should be. Yeah. Drill, 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 drill the blood letter. I will move on ahead. Wonderful. As opposed to the rest of them who should probably be, you know pulling themselves back together, but okay, you do you, hero. There is not much time, brothers, but we must prepare for the coming battle. Hello, I can sense enemy reinforcements. 
Palamedes, resuscitate Uther, so you may both defend against them. That's nice. Okay, back with you. Let's, um... The first time a nice reduces zero HP, he is critically wounded, cannot fight for three turns. Presumably the second time, he is dead, dead, dead. I dare say we'll find out the hard way. Alright. And confirm that. Welcome back, brother. Take up defensive positions, Palamedes. The enemy reinforcements will be here soon. Alright. Duck and come, brother. Makes sense. Your resolve is commendable. Join Palamedes in defense of the cathedral. Your complete absence of common sense, somewhat less so. Iolanthus with me. There's a breach in the wall ahead. I will breach the inner sanctum. Yes, which totally isn't overrun. It's bloodthirst at time, isn't it? Two AP. And it tells you how many AP you're going to burn each time. <laughs> ah! Cultists. Interestingly, only five of them. Where are the other three? Blood was probably not the best solution here. Very cool. Captain. <laughs> oh, never mind, he's already dead. Millions of souls feed the flame. The threshold is past. The warp emerges. Your cult is broken. My Your buddy is coming is through ended. the window. Relish this breath, for it is your last. Blood for the blood god! Skulls for the skull! He's a happy <laughs> Ah, goody. That's a lot of. Well, not to a my lot side, of demons, but, uh, Simply jump the gap by moving. Okay, so small fishes are not a problem. They will simply let you uh, move. Bonk. I will show you true wrath, demon. Okay. So are you? You are seriously going close quarters with a greater demon of course. Ah, well, that's very heroic. Um, that may just be another word for very stupid. Poke it with a stick! Uther, we must protect the cathedral! Oh, the eye. Right, Overwatch. Lock one. Confirm. And Overwatch. Can't help but think that dropping some healing onto Brother Uther would help, but uh, let's be honest here, great paladins named Uther tend not to be very long. <laughs> That's a new trick. Oh dear. Never surrender. <laughs> yep, second down is dead. Our right. brothers have bought us precious time, Iolanthus. Flank that demon and fire at will. Select a way oh right, so you can set waypoints with a left click. And shoot. For the Emperor! Oh, that it's going to do. You profane this sacred place with your master's fire. This ends now, demon. Just between you and me, I, uh, I think it was pretty well profaned anyway. 
Well, I suppose Terminator armor is meant to be fireproof, but really? Okay, let's be stupid, shall we? Ah. Oh. Ah. Fall. Nom? <laughs> that will not have done the stone. Stabby, stabby, stab. Wait, what? Really? Scripting, I suppose, but, um. Pathetic mortal! Weakling spawn of a false god! I am the light that burnishes darkness. Your prayers mean nothing! Does that extend to the, uh... Ooh. That's gonna be a mark. I am the hammer! I have a buddy right behind me. What is he doing? You have beaten me for now, little knight. But the war I fight is eternal! Turned out all we had to do was poke him a couple more times. Um, teleport recall, Liz. So we have 25% casualties. A Analysis. Yeah. Group signatures fading. Then the blood ritual has ended. Where is that report? Report. Where is the commander? He's here, mostly. He died in Champion's death. Uh oh. Blade on blade against the Bowers blasphemy. That's unfortunate. Oh well, there's always a dreadnought. Didn't look that bad. I mean, it didn't hit anything vital, did it? Victory. Yes, victory. An Imperial world hopelessly tainted by the warp, 50% casualties amongst the Grey Knight squad sent in to get it, and a senior officer dead. <sighs> the sad thing is that by the sounds of the Grey Knights, that's probably an average day at the office. Your commander has fallen, but all is not lost. Your knights each have a special resource called resilience. They will eventually earn more resilience, however, okay. How many critical risks are saved for their injuries require they be returned to home on Titan? Note, their remains be returned home because, well, dead, dead, dead. Right. So, is he back? Yeah, they're not going to be using that world for anything else, are they? So Lucio Tertius has just turned into Exactus A Nob long campaign. Over at last. A victory at the cost of the commander's life. Alive, he was ever a faithful servant to the Emperor. A true hero. In death, at least his duty has finally ended. You don't really retire, the Space Marines. This ship remains in crisis. The Baleful Edict is seriously damaged. There are grievous matters to attend. Ah, yes. That is why I have invited our guest. You have appointed him to take the commander's place? Hi? No one else suitable survived the campaign. Oh, thank you. Falsehood. You also live. My apologies, Acting Commander. The priests of Mars do not understand our knightly oaths. <laughs> <laughs> our men and stores are severely diminished. Your task is to lead us for the voyage home. 
It is a simple duty, and once we return to Titan, I will put the future of your command to the chapter's grandmasters. Lovely. In the meantime, I will provide what advice I can. So, I will also support you with counsel and service, but remember, the Baleful Edict is my chief concern. Be careful with this ship. We sail for Titan on your word, Commander. Well, get going then. Home sweet home! Strike for Xyphos at your disposal. I've been pressured with so many about Xyphos and Xyphos at my disposal. Commander, could you please join me in the Strategium? Okay. One of our battle brothers has proved himself worthy. Let us honor his deeds. Yay! Oh, Iolanthus, congratulations. Iolanthus. Brother Ulrich is a talented Justica. Please decide where he should focus his training to support you in the field. With every promotion, your knights gain two ability points, which you can use to expand their capabilities. So, Terminator armor. Plus four health. Plus two willpower. Okay, let's go with plus health because, you know, I like not dying. And as much as I would love to convert Terminator armor, Grey Knight's crit range weapons plus 10 crit. Rapid reload when this Knight Samuel reaches 0, 50, And they can now equip a Psy Cannon. Discipline, crushing charm, honor the chapter, all gives slots equipment. Right, so leadership discipline pretty much takes you into enhancing everybody. Ah, thank you for the uh, heresy, penguin. Yay! And hammerhand discipline, 100% so crit, crit damage, bleed, willpower. Or go defensive with Terminator armor. Which would render him slower, but a Terminator on the job wouldn't be a bad thing. Alright. So we'll get him Terminator training, we'll give him some extra health. Confirming this promotion will apply your ability choices to Ulrich permanently increase. Thank you. Okay, so. Back up to the Excellent. Strategium. When you are finished, please join me at the star map. Thank you. In other words, please join him at the star map. In other words, join him at the star map, whether you want to or not. Our ship is in dire need of repair. We had best set a course for Titan and debrief the Grand Masters. Okay, so we are currently here. Bonk, 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 bonk. Right. Issue the travel order to begin our return to Titan. Yay! Engage! Just a quick jaunt through hell and hope nobody notices. I mean, what's the worst that could happen? Ah, so time is limited. One sub jump. Two sub jumps. Three, and we're interrupted. En route to Titan. Oh, Master Pathogen in Titus Sector. What yanked us out of the war? Baleful Edict in the name of the God Emperor. Dominus, who is this? They intro? know who we are. Code scrapings indicate an inquisitorial transmission. They know who we are. Baleful Edict, prepare for my arrival. Duty calls, Commander. We should open a Vox link. And a hangar bay. Inquisitorial vessel, permission granted to come aboard. That's a bit premature. But, okay. Uh, time is relative, but only in Freebird. Now, what does the Inquisition want?
Wait, since when were Valkyries drop people? I mean, okay, it's an Inquisitorial Valkyrie, so it's probably modified, but I was pretty sure those things were air breathing only. Well, yes, I'm being a nerd. Which way the plot needs it to be, yes, pretty much. Here's the Inquisition, watch out, sin. Here's the Inquisition, now let us begin. Oh, Thank she the God Emperor, so well. I found you. I must commandeer this vessel at once. Your Rosette, Inquisitor. We are bound for Titan. The Edict cries out for repair. Wrong answer, Lynette. The Tech Priest speaks the truth, Inquisitor. Our last crusade bled us dry. I'm not blind, Knight. But heresy does not operate at our convenience. My destination is Koromar Prime, within this very system. Not such a taxing journey, I'd expect. And what is it that you hope to find there? This. Beneath rotting skies, the air thickens with a world's final breath. Oh, Seeds planted in flesh and bone, watered with blood and tears. A warrior alone in the garden of a grinning god. These are scraps of astropathic whimsy. There's more. It grows. It spreads. A great dispersal upon the etheric wind. The bloom proliferating. First, then Korama, then world after world, its roots spread from an ancient veil. Inquisitor, hear me, hear me, hear me! Who tends the garden? The Astropath sacrificed himself to send that message. Now you understand why we must investigate. Commander. We cannot risk further damage to this vessel. It is the chapter ship, Dominus. The Inquisitor has every right to request our support. It is not a request. <laughs> Commander, with your leave, we will set our course for this Koromar Prime. Yes. Good. That will do for now. Rosette? Anybody? Detected. All right, what have we got? Also, I have to note that it didn't end in the normal way. Usually when astropaths have things that bad, their heads explode. All right, worlds of flavor disease, and this is higher than anticipation. We should investigate this. Further. If we do not investigate this threat, the consequences will be dire. Yes, yes, yes. Light infestation, it's all the problem. She's sort of person. Okay, that's uh, simple enough. Commander, it is our duty to support this Inquisitor. But we should complete this task as swiftly as we can. The Grand Masters on Titan are waiting for our report. Yes, but we do need to drop in and deal with this first. So, hit the astropathic nexus, extract the logs that we can, find out what's going on. Then hoover up the surfaces and leave. Report. Signals from quarantine beacons detected in the upper atmosphere, but the surface itself is silent. Hmm. Not good. Plague, Commander. Send your squad to the surface. Knights of Titan, you are the instrument of the Emperor's will. Make planet fall and discover if the Inquisitor's fears are founded. Spoiler alert. Be you fine, should please. evaluate your knight's armaments and ensure they are best suited to the battle at hand. All right, armor type. Do I? Ah, I do. The uh, Nemesis melee. Force Halberd can inflict a preemptive first strike on an adjacent enemy. Choose which halberd you would like to equip. Your options will be limited until we return to Titan. Translation, you have no options at all. Force strike and, oh, 
Adjacent, 25% once per turn chance of getting a strike in as he closes in. Frag grenade tier 1, that's Storm Bolter. Okay. Armor type, uh, turn suit please, brother. Yoink. Welcome to the Heavy Brigade. Unfortunately, no melee, but he is my heavy support. Voldred, four sword, no doubt, ranged weapon, only gets storm bolters. On the other hand, grenade, frag grenade again, should work for dealing with the locals. And another halberd, might be an idea. Who does not yet have the ability to deploy Terminator armor? You know what, if there's... I'm going to say there are two people who should probably have Terminator suits here. And uh, let's be completely candid here. The Apothecary, the Medic, is probably the best candidate. Just give me one quick second. I need to tweak something. Boop, boop. There we go. Hopefully that's got the uh, volume a bit more reasonable. Right, to the Teleportarium. Four knights, so Justicar and Inceptor on point. Apothecary in the middle, Purgator is fire support in the rear. Should do the trip. Through hell we go, and into hell we charge. I'm not joking, by the way. Alright. Let's see what the good folk of the soap dodging cult have got for us. <sighs> Commander, have your men look for signs of this plague. Be vigilant, brothers. What, you mean like the overgrown tree, the fact that nobody's on comms and. All right. Hold up. Got the Terminator suit after all. All right. First things first. Bring up the apothecary. Set him into partial cover, and we'll also set Overwatch on the other. Huh. Wrong person. Your command. Right, Purgator. Um, move ranged attack. Select like the target from range attack. Okay, right, so we'll dig him in to. Oh, I see. One AP point remaining, and that's my limit for movement. Okay, so it tells you how many a action points you have left after each action. That's actually kind of handy. Um, it would actually be quite useful to be set up there for Overwatch, wouldn't it? Okay, let's park him here for a moment. Yes. Confirm that. And then set Overwatch. Confirm. are trained and ready. That is not technically a bolt. Right? I, but I, will, uh, I will forgive you on this one and get the other melee spec into position. Go, oh, Spets Marines, go. And while we're at it, Overwatch, set, and confirm. Ah. The bloom rises. That doesn't sound ominous at all, does it? An enemy patrol is detected. Ah, just up ahead. 
wonder if we can get a good ambush in. I'm going to say the cactus is a bad sign, by the way. Right. Here's Commander. Let's see, can you set yourself up? Yes, you can. Right. It will be done. Okay, in position. And... Overwatch forward again. They shall not pass! Well, they will if he runs out of ammunition. The Emperor likes our path. Uh, do, 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 do. Alright. Soft cover there. Yep, perfect. Taking Go. position. Set up. Standing ready. Alright. Off the carry. I am here to serve. Yes, yes, yes. Set yourself up on that flank. Can they actually shoot at that? We're gonna find out. Um, we're gonna find out. It's just a crater, and, and they are seven foot tall, genetically engineered badasses with another six inches from the armor. I think they can. And if not, well, there's always charging in and going stampy. All right, set up Overwatch. In fact, yeah, it tells you if line of sight is blocked. Look at what it's doing with the cactus. So that's kind of useful. Alright. Set and confirm. Ready to fire. Arc 30, range 7. Good. Probably. Bunching them up is asking for a grenade. On the other hand, power up. On my way. And, you know, heaping pile of overwatch fire. Confirm, everyone's in place. Where is that patrol? Nowhere convenient, but uh, they're getting closer. Alright. Yes, Commander. Safety move. Ah, cultists! Us. Commander, we've made contact with the enemy. They're chaos cultists. That's actually cute. Right, you can highlight the enemy and press middle mouse button to view. Suppressive fire. Target knight under cover at range 14 if that happens. Easy. Okay. Autos, hunker down, cover shot, and range 14 destroy that. Okay, so he might actually be a bit of a problem if I let him get set up and going. Your basic vanilla cultist. Bit of AP. Longer range than my Stormbolt, I might add. Range 8 compared to range 7. And hunker down. What is your will? Um, your orders? Brother, what is the range on your frag grenade? Not enough. Hmm. Why? Actually, it might work. Or is that... That's not quite enough to get them, is it? That's irritating. On the bright side, it doesn't need to be. Quick hop over here. Oh, way. Hello, heretics! Not that. Oh, hang on. Uh, don't confirm. Denounce. Oh, never mind. Psy cannon. Do you 
you have range? No. For you. Cancel. Outside. And which of these fools has the heavy stuff? On the one hand, that fool would be down to one health point. Explosive create area three to deal five damage. Okay. We hit this guy with just a regular attack. Psychic console. Never mind. That'll kill both of them. Confer. Will be done. I am the Emperor's fury. Indeed. Your knights will gain one willpower for destroying most knights. Excellent. So the more we kill, the more we can kill. Thank you. It is good to know service. these things. Right. Um, okay, new plan. Back it up. Um, Brother Ector, would you please remove your advice from my face? Advance forward. Switch to a ranged attack. And then blow him up. I am his and then there was one. Alright. Do I have a cover option here? No, not really, because the purgator is standing. Sorry, the. Interceptor is standing right where I need him to be. On the other hand, it's not going to matter, is it? Fine. Go kill. Bonk, 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 crunch, stab. Target destroyed. All right. Uh, it's. It's kind of the little version of Custodian Spears, or you could regard Custodian Spears as the Gucci version of the Nemesis Force uh, halberd. Although technically, um, they're not for Custodian weapons aren't force weapons, are they? All right, let's get into cover. With haste. Advance the apothecary and set him in. Overwatch. Oh, let's bring up the rest of the squad. Unleash me. I'm here to serve. Oh, he only has one frag grenade. Okay. Lesson learned. Irritatingly, but uh, lesson learned. I'm right, gonna have to risk putting him out into the open. Seeking the tainted. Yoink. Kill everybody. Shouldn't be too hard. Right, bring up the fire Ooh. support. Taking position. Cover is, after all, slightly irrelevant when you are wearing an inch of ceramite armor and everything else. Orders. Or you're a Terminator and you give no, absolutely no cares about anyone except. Well, anti-tank weapons. The pool's close. Let the hunt continue. Aha! Right. Okay. We will set Overwatch as well. I don't think they're going to get involved, but you never know. Hello, heretics! 55% uh, on the blue rise. That could be awkward. Right. Yes, Commander. Let's see. Yes, Commander. Cover. And set my overwatch. Waiting for targets. Advance up. Moving out.
Brother, do you need to reload? No, I don't believe you do. Fine. Actually, that's because you have actually shot him on the isn't it? Yoink. Make your safety moves. Always make your safety moves first. The question is, which patrol, or is there only one patrol to engage? There may only be the one patrol, so yes, sir. move them up. <laughs> ah! <laughs> plague, um... Wait, that creature... Is a plague Even zombie. We have seen the dead walk in this way before. As have I. Poxwalkers are evidence of warp corruption. This is no natural plague. Happily, they go down just the same if you throw a grenade at them. Yep, that'll do. Confirm. Turns out, the best antidote to a Nurgle plague. Yeah, it, it's My habit, Takru, it's habit. But yes, I agree that the standard guard approach of uh, I think all that the standard guard approach of bounding Overwatch does not really help here. Um, oh, he can he can shoot again. Fine, I ain't complaining. I need to examine this corpse. I will not tolerate this contamination spreading to my servitors. Do not obstruct me, tech priest. I will follow proper protocols. Ah, he got around the open. Um. Oh, hey. That's new. And highly unwelcome. Right. <laughs> First things first. Okay, start by stabbing that one, please. Thank you. And then toss a grenade on that bunch. No match for the Emperor's Chosen. What is your will? Or for that matter, a volley of Stormbolt fire. Probably best if we don't let this lot get into melee range. Satisfactory effort. Now return with my carcass so I can set to work. Wow. We will deliver them to you as soon as containment is properly confirmed and sanctified. Be swift about it. If this plague has already spread beyond this planet, then we will have far more ground to cover. Fair point. Fair point. Victory! Yes, the Emperor's Finest, the product of decades of training, centuries of experience, millennia of knowledge. And we shoved over a bunch of cultists and a small pack of zombies. Hmm. Still did better than the PDF.